Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve the AMD software package error. This says error 1603. A general error has occurred during the installation of the AMD software package. So, this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So, we're going to start off by opening up the search menu and search for a control panel. Best match should come back with control panel. Go ahead and open that up. Say your view by to category view. And then underneath programs, select where it says uninstall a program. Locate anything that says Visual C++ in the name of it. And go ahead and left click on it. And select the change button. Select the repair option. And select yes if you receive a user account control prompt. And I'm gonna actually not going to restart my computer this time. I'm going to do the other Visual C++ entry in here as well, same procedure. And then we're going to restart our computer once that's done. And then select close. And I would suggest restarting your computer at this time. So there you go. Hopefully that was able to resolve the issue. If not, something else we can try as well if you go on to a web browser here and just search for AMD Radon software and go ahead and search for that. Best result should be an AMD website here. This is AMD drivers and support. You go ahead and open that up here. And then you can go ahead and search for your product in specific model information in this list. You would select Submit, and then you would go ahead and actually download the applicable software for your device. So again, that's going to be custom for your computer. You can check your system properties if you're unsure of exactly what hardware you're using. But anyway, go ahead and select either the Windows 10 or Windows 11 download here, and then you'll select the Download button. And depending on your internet connection, it might take a little bit of time. It's about 544 megabytes in size. And once it's done downloading, go ahead and open up that file. And select yes if you receive a user account control prompt. And select install. Okay, so I don't actually have an AMD card on this computer, so that's why it's not going to let me install it here. And then you just would continue on with the installation process from here. So hopefully that would have been able to resolve the problem. One final thing we can attempt as well, open up the search menu, type in CMD. Best match should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, select yes. And now I will have a DISM command in the description of my video, guys. I want you to copy it. And then go up to the top bar of the command prompt window here. Right click on it. Select edit and then paste it in. Give us a couple minutes to run.
Okay, so once that's done, go ahead and close out of here and then restart your computer. And there you go, guys. So hopefully that was able to help resolve your problem. And as always, thank you for watching. Do a positive will help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.